my name is Magdalene Janney. If you are new, welcome to the family. Please don't forget to subscribe and join because we're always here hanging out. And of course, welcome back to all my oldies, my goodies. So you guys, back with another lip swatching video. Revlon just released these Colorstay Matte Light Crayons. I don't have anything on my lips. If my lips look a little crusty, it's because they are. They are really, really dry. Here in LA, it's literally been 90 degrees the last five days and it's that very dry, dry heat. So the lips look dry AF. So my favorite lip product and ointment chapstick type is this andy ointment you can even see how much i use it because all tore up also drinking a lot of water does help smooth out lips too make them really really soft you guys know how much i love lip swatching video especially for you guys because i know you guys like it and it's drugstore okay if you are new and never seen a lip swatching video of mine i usually do lip swatches in studio lighting and in daylight so you can get the real look and different lighting of the actual color and i'm taking advantage today because it's 90 degrees it's hot and the sun's gonna be beaming so you're gonna get some good sunlight today so what I do is lip swatch everything at the beginning and then towards the end of the video I talk to you guys about these I do want to show you the component this is how it looks wrapped up and then let's see oh it's pointy does it have anything on oh, it has the sharpener okay nice nice before we get started I do want to show you the order we're gonna go in kind of lightest to darkest and yeah, I'm so excited. Starting off with the first one, Tread Lightly. This is the shade Tread Lightly. And in daylight, this is Tread Lightly. Next one up is Clear the Air. This is the shade Clear the Air. And in daylight, Clear the Air. Next one up is Take Flight. This is the shade Take Flight. And in daylight, this is Take Flight. Next one up is Souffle All Day. This is the shade Souffle All Day. Daylight is the Souffle All Day. Next one up is Mile High. This is the shade Mile High. And in daylight, this is Mile High. Next one up is Ruffled Feathers. This is the shade Ruffled Feathers. And in daylight, this is Ruffled Feathers.
Next one up is Air Kiss. This is the shade Air Kiss. And in daylight, this is Air Kiss. Next one up is Lifted. This is the shade Lifted. And in daylight, this is Lifted. Next one up is Sky High. This is the shade Sky High. And in daylight, there's a sky high. Last but not least is On Cloud Wine. And in daylight, this is On Cloud Wine. All right, guys, this is it. This is the final one. And oh, this plum shade is bomb. It does match the actual color. So that's always nice because sometimes the colors do change when they go up on your lip. They go on very creamy, but they do dry down as a bat. Very similar to the Maybelline Superstay Matte Crayons. They even have the sharpener that's very similar or exactly like the Maybelline. But I find that these go on a little more on the creamier side, but they do dry down very, very matte. Literally, I try to go back and I went like this and a piece broke off of this one. So keep in mind, I, pro I had it out too much. So I bought mine at CVS. I couldn't find them anywhere else. I'm sure they will be in additional stores in the coming months. I will link everything down below. Anywhere I can find them, I'll link it so you can pick it up if you want. So these retail for $11.99 on CVS website. So this is an effortless crayon lipstick that is so lightweight you'll forget it's even on. It feels 30% lighter than your average lipstick and it is infused with antioxidants, rich mango seed oil to replenish the lips. Experience saturated matte lipstick color in a comfortable non-drying matte formula. It apparently comes in 12 shades but I was able to get 10 so dang I wanted to get all 12 but it's okay you guys got the majority at first I wasn't sure because I'm like they just look like Maybelline and I don't know I just wasn't too wowed but we know we love us a good drugstore lipstick but once I was applying these shades on they look so freaking beautiful in both lighting the only one I basically didn't like was this hot pink I personally don't like hot pink or pinks in general but that's not the reason this one was kind of transparent you had to build it up and when you build it up it looked a little bit chalky not sure if you were able to see the chalkiness but I was able to see it and it kind of picked up a lot of the texture on your lips. I have very textured lips. My lips wrinkle a lot, so I don't want a lipstick to accentuate that even more. It's funny because it looked nice, but when you got close, it was just like, mm, not really. Do you know what I'm saying? But let's see if they are transfer proof because it claims they are. I've had it on for maybe like five minutes now. 
transfer a little bit. And something I really, really loved was the ease of applying these. These went on, glided on nicely, and because they are kind of pointy, except here, let me get a real pointy one. They have this point, you're able to outline your lips perfectly. You probably don't even need a lip liner when you use this and it dries down kind of like a lip liner does. So it's like a two in one. It's a lip liner and a matte lipstick. The lips don't feel drying, but you know it's dried down. They were easy to come off. That's another thing. With matte lipsticks, I'm always scared and skeptical how they're gonna come off when I'm doing lip swatches. If I'm gonna have to really tug on my lip or just kind of do a little quick swipe. I was able to do a quick swipe and they just removed easily. So that's always nice. You know, they smell kind of like the Maybelline Super Stay lipsticks, the lip crayons, but then the scent goes away pretty quickly. So it doesn't linger. At first I was like, there's a lot of shades that look similar, but they didn't. Once I applied them on, I'm like, okay, I see how they look. They look really, really nice. When it comes to plum shades like these two, a lot of times they come on the lips and they apply on the lips very patchy. That happens a lot with plum shades because of the shade or the formula, but these didn't patch up at all. Once it dries down, it still looks the same. So the fact that these did not patch up, that's very rare. I don't really see that when it comes to these types of shade sky high it was a very different shade i really like it's like a purple magenta in one i thought it was gonna be too purple i don't like two purple shades because they make my teeth look really stained beautiful if i have to pick one favorite shade it is this one because it's different it applied so nicely and i actually wanted to apply it right now but i'm like no, that's gonna be a mission and a half. You know what I'm saying? You get exactly what it is. It is a matte lip crayon. Is it 12 hour wear? Not really, cause let's try again. Yeah, it's still, you see it's still transferring. It's not super smudge proof. Because it does have mango seed oil, you do feel a bit of hydration. Therefore, it's not gonna completely dry down. It's gonna transfer a little bit because of that oil. And as we can see, it is transferring. Here, let me get my napkin. My, ooh, my. Oh my god look this is the piece that broke off and imagine you sit on it or something girl that's a mess okay let's yeah you see you see what i'm saying i'll wait around maybe about 20 minutes to see if it just dries down want to show you guys let's see oh yeah it just needs time to dry down the longer you let it dry the better your lips will stay i had so much fun lip watching these and let me know your thoughts have you seen them around have you worn revlon lipsticks which one is your favorite color oh these are so cute nothing like a good terracotta shade and nothing like this shade right here you know thank you so much for hanging out with me and spending a little bit of your day with me please don't forget to like subscribe click the button right here and i'll see you in the next one bye